fashion trends come and go, but there are some pieces that never ever go out of style. And for that reason, we should never part with them. Hi, I'm Leonie and welcome back to my channel. It's really easy to make some fatal mistakes when we're clearing out our closet and purge some pieces that we will ultimately regret later on. And that's why in today's video, I'm sharing the top pieces that you should never ever spring clean from your closet. So if you'd like to see what they are, you know the drill, just keep watching. Before I get started on today's video, I'd just like to say a very big thank you to the team at June's Journey for sponsoring today's video. Now, if you haven't heard of June's Journey before, it's one of my favorite free games that I play on my phone. It's kind of a game for grown-ups too, which is probably why I like it. It's a murder mystery style game and it's set in the 20s. I love the fashion of the 20s. You'll see when you check out the game. And you play a character called June. Now, as I said, it's a murder mystery and June is trying to figure out who murdered her sister. So you basically just go from scene to scene. You're given a task of finding specific objects and these then become clues to cracking the case. June's Journey is available on Apple and Android devices. I'll leave a link in the description box below so you guys can download it and have some fun too. Okay, the number one thing that I think we all need to hang on to is our blazers. Now, blazers aren't always in fashion. They're not always on trend, but they actually never go out of style. And yes, I know they change shapes and sizes. Sometimes they're oversized boyfriend style. Sometimes they're a little bit cropped. But no matter what, you can put on a blazer and transform a simple pair of jeans and a t-shirt and just elevate the look. So for me, blazers are a absolute go-to and for that reason, you should never ever get rid of them. Another trend that seems to fluctuate in popularity but it never disappears is a good skinny jean. Skinny jeans really do flatter your figure. They look great worn with a fuller, slightly oversized top. They're great for tucking into boots in winter and they are definitely the one item that you will want to replace and you'll regret tossing. So hold on to those skinny jeans. If there's one shoe style that you'll come back to every winter, it is a classic black ankle boot. They pretty much go with everything. They're comfortable, they are chic and stylish and they're also weatherproof. So if it's raining or snowing, or the weather is bad, the dark black ankle boot will hide a multitude of sins. So they are one item that you should really never part with. Oh, and I'd love to hear in the comments below the one piece of clothing that you will never ever part with. For me, it's a black leather motorcycle jacket that I bought on sale. I've owned it for years. I pull it out every winter. It goes with everything and it always looks cool. So it is the one piece I will never part with. Let me know what yours is. It's really tempting to part with some of those chunky knits at the end of a long cold winter, but I urge you not to because they may not be the most stylish piece that you own, but they are a really hard working go-to piece. They're perfect for layering under some of your heavier weight coats and they always keep you warm and snuggly and they never go out of fashion. So hold on to those chunky knits. A good pair of white sneakers are the equivalent to a basic classic white tee. And for that reason, you need to hold on to them. The only reason I would get rid of a pair of white sneakers is if they have seen better days and they just don't look white white anymore. But otherwise they are a good classic piece. Yes, the the styles will change a little from season to season, but it's not enough to make you pass them on and, and update unless they really need updating. But I think a good classic white sneaker is a really good staple that you need to hold on to. We really shouldn't part with our designer handbags either. When you think about it, we've made a decent investment in them and yes, styles do change, but these pieces actually never really go out of fashion. And also think about designer handbags. The vintage handbags are coming back and creating really cool looks and outfits as well. I was gifted a couple of Louis Vuitton handbags a number of years ago. I'll never part with them because I know that they are classics and I'll probably never be able to replace them. And also I will, and I do from time to time, pull them out and style them with outfits and they do just elevate the look. So 
when you are tempted to part with those designer handbags, you may not have worn them for a number of years, but don't worry about that, hold on to them. Denim jackets are a closet staple, and for that reason, even though cuts and styles change from season to season, classic denim jackets never ever go out of fashion. So if you've got a, a denim jacket in a wash that you like, don't part with it. Even if for whatever reason that season, the trend might be for lighter wash denim jackets, hold on to it because your wash will come back and you will definitely regret parting with a denim jacket. Oh, and if it looks like my skin is glowing in this video, don't be fooled. I'm actually sweating. It's super hot here in Auckland today. It's about 100% humidity. I don't know why I wore a long sleeve top in this video. As soon as I finish, I'll be whipping it off and cooling down. But just in case you thought that I was glowing today, it's, it's just an illusion, so don't worry. <laughs> but that does lead me on to my next piece, which I think we should all hang on to, and that is the classic slip dress. Now, slip dresses are really enjoying a bit of a moment right now, but you know they are always in fashion and always look stylish no matter what. I love the fact that they are trending at the moment. That basically means that I can update a few of my own classic slip dresses, but really they are pieces that you can wear in all sorts of different ways. You can dress them up at night, you can wear them more casually with trainers or, or layer a t-shirt underneath them. They are a really good versatile piece and for that reason, they need to stay where they are in your closet. If you own a pair of aviator sunglasses, hold on to them. They are the most flattering style for most face shapes. They are pretty much always on trend, regardless of what is happening in terms of sunglass shapes and styles. So don't ever part with your aviators, they will always look great. I've talked about the importance of holding on to your classic white sneakers. Another shoe that will always remain in my closet, it's a look that I absolutely love, is a pair of Converse All Stars. Now I own about three or four pairs, whether they're white, black, colored. This shoe, if you like this particular look, will stand the test of time. So it's a, a shoe that you should always hold on to regardless of whether chunky style dad sneakers are trending, whatever's happening in footwear, a pair of Converse All Stars will always serve you well, so hold on to them. Now last but not least is a great leather jacket. If you have invested in a leather jacket, hang on to it, regardless of what is happening in fashion. You can be absolutely guaranteed that your style of leather jacket will come back into fashion, but regardless of whether it's in fashion or not, you can still elevate any look by just throwing on a leather jacket. There's also such a return to vintage styling at the moment that even if your leather jacket does look like it's from a different era, it's really not going to matter. So any leather jacket or coat that you own is definitely a keeper. Anyway, that's it from me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love you to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now. I won't make it easy for you now You got two minutes of my time And I don't really break too easily But I'm worth it Cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight Oh, So give me, so give me your heart